Hello everyone and welcome to Wildflowers. My name is Melanie V. It is now Monday and it's the 39th day of summer. Okay, let's head down to the basement and see what's ready. Revitalizing potions ready. Okay, the honey mint cooler. Still got some time left on that. Okay, and a fall ritual incantation. We can make that still. Um, whoops. So bring the fall ritual incantation to the high priestess. And we can also deliver some wood to Parker. Oops. And patch things up. We still need a little less than a hundred, just eighty-six dollars more. And we still need to talk to two three more people about the uh, rain. Okay. We'll head outside. It looks like the lime tree is ready. We'll collect that. Okay, so that's almost able to complete one of our quests. We just need one more. And the compost is not ready yet. Let's go see Lefty. Okay, we got a chicken feather. I'll grab that. And we'll go see Blossom next. Oh, look at her. Hello, Blossom. Okay, Blossom is doing just fine. And we should probably go say hello to Cleopatra. And I just realized how slow I'm going. <laughs> Listen to that purr. And we got a cricket and a bone from Cleopatra. Okay. So, we need to speed up a bit. So we'll need to craft another incantation for that. Let's go get this soil. Okay, so we need to get a speed boost spell. What are we missing? Oh, we need more seaweed. Okay, I guess we'll have to go down to the beach. We'll have to go really slow down to the beach, unfortunately. Okay, so hopefully we can sell enough stuff today that we can actually get... Parker to come out and start on that plot. Let's grab this witch weed. Okay, we'll grab all the forage on the beach. Oh, looks like there's some fish here. Let's go ahead and do a little fishing. We'll use the worm. <laughs> We'll wait for the next fish. Oh, quick! Nope, we're gonna have to pass on that one. Come on, other fish, jump on there. Oh, oh no. 
It's not giving me the right one. There we go. Okay, we got a shrimp, finally. Let's say hello to Kai. Almost time to put on my thicker wetsuits. And the thicker a wetsuit is, the more you have to do a crazy chicken dance to get your legs out. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, still no seaweed. Let's say hello to Francis. That lemonade stand is cute, but it also seems like it's bringing Lena and Parker together more often. Not to be a gossip, but they don't spend that much time with each other, do they? I wouldn't know. Okay, let's head over to Parker. So the quest we have for Parker, how much does that pay? 114? Okay, so that should be enough to get us the plot started. You just need to make it over there. In spite of how slow we are going. Okay, there's Parker. Okay, so we'll turn in the request. Hey now, thanks. And we can get the vegetable patch done. Yeah, we have everything. Let me get my wheelbarrow, and I'll be right over to set up your new patch. Should only take a day or so. Fantastic. Okay, let's see who else is in town. Let's say hello to Cameron. I came across Giva wrapping up a meditation session on the beach and we got to talking. Turns out we have more in common than I might have imagined. I'm glad she's here. Okay, well that's good. Amira's clinic is closed. Let's say hello to Damon. Hey, that new meteorologist is kind of cute, yeah? Don't think I'm her type, though. <laughs> I don't think so, Damon. Say hello to Lena. Thanks again for helping the kids with their stand. Of course, now Emmy's asking for a credit card so she can start building her credit. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can purchase. Um, I don't think I need any of these things. Oh, that was for selling. I think I might hang on to all of it. Okay. We'll talk to Juliet. At first, I only bought lemonade from Emmy and Finn because I'm their babysitter, but it's actually good. Like, really good. So, Emmy and Finn makes good lemonade. Okay, uh, let's see how the mayor's doing. You see? It rained! It's proof that all this town needs is a positive outlook and good leadership. But you didn't make it rain. Good leadership is what is needed to keep morale high and get us through any time of crisis. Ugh, he's so conceited. It's nice to see Parker and Lena teaching their kids to run a business. That's how we'll keep that entrepreneurial spirit strong in Fairhaven for the next generation. Why does he have to be so loud? Okay, um, let's see what Angus is up to today. 
Parker's been bringing the twins to the Consciousness Center since they're not in school, and man, they're cute. But uh, they're affirming my belief that I don't really want kids. <laughs> okay, so who else can we ask about the rain? Maybe Chiba? Okay, let's head into the woods. Maybe we can do a bit of foraging, get a mandrake or two. I guess we'll chop down some wood. We got a peanut. And we're chopping down some more wood. Now we'll take the peanut. Oh, there we go. We'll take that mandrake. And we'll go over to the coven. Um, I don't want to change it to fall just yet. So if I use my boat to get to Ravenwood Hollow, how does everyone else get there? A different form of transportation reveals itself to each of us over time. Mine, for example, is a funicular. And no one can see it but me. Wow. I thought my boat was cool. Now I find out that I could have had a bullet train or a penny farthing bike. <sighs> My familiar started clawing at our back door and then prancing over to the couch like it's his. Sebastian's like, why is this cat so chill with you? And I'm like, uh, who knows? Cats, dude. <laughs> okay, um, let's head back over to the farm. I think we have enough energy to maybe chop down some trees. And we can also do a little bit of foraging. So yeah, let's head back to the farm. Okay, so let's clear out some of these trees. We're probably getting low on wood now. Uh, not really. We still have a lot of it. Doesn't hurt to have extras though. Okay, got a poppy. Let's be sure to get all these weeds. Oh, we got some mushroom over here. Okay, I think this is lots. Okay, let's check out the other side. Any forage to be had? Oh, I can't believe how slow I'm going right now. I really need to get another speed boost spell right away. I should probably check on the honey. That one's pretty close. Not there yet. That one's getting there. Okay, let's go down to the basement and see what's ready. Um, 
I'd like to make another miracle grow in here. Or should I make some levitation potions? Yeah, let's do that. And uh, we got the honey mint cooler. I'm gonna make some more essence of copper. Okay, let's head to bed. I'm sleepy. <sighs> okay, for crying drought loud, a summer drought has dried up all of the town. Ask around to see how your neighbors are doing, so we need to find two more people still. And Parker is working on our vegetable patch right now. Okay. And our apple tree is ready. We'll take those. Got some lemons. And some mulberries as well. And there's Parker, hard at work. Let's say hello to Cleocatra. Come here! We got a cricket. I really need to get down to the beach and get some seaweed. There you go, Lefty. And we've got another chicken feather. Let's go find Blossom. There she is. Okay, let's go on down to the beach and hope we can find some seaweed. I should probably give my broom a try. Let's go to the other side of the beach as well. Oh, looks like there are some berries up here to forage. Okay, what's down on the beach? I really need some seaweed. <laughs> like, really, really need some. Okay, no seaweed. Oh, and I have those fish I can give to Bruno now. Or the shrimp. Let me grab this witch weed. Oh no, there's no seaweed. Maybe I'll see Shelby today and I can purchase some from him. Okay, let's head over to town. Oh, Wesley's visiting. Hey, Wesley. So, the new rancher... No, I am not going to eat his livestock. I have more self-control than that. I was just going to ask if you'd met him yet. Oh. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
I should really try figuring out what gifts I can give to people. Let's say hello to Kim. That new rancher keeps staring at me. Like, he's clocked me, but he does not know what time it is. I hate it when people do that. <laughs> Let's see what Kai has for sale. So he has olive, chili, and silkworm. I will actually buy a chili. And we don't have very much money left. <laughs> Let's turn in these shrimp to Bruno. Just what I was asking for. Thanks kindly. Okay. Let's see what we can sell. Okay, can't buy or catch no sell your bait until this drought is over. Oh. Okay. Okay, let's talk to Damon. Sorry, Sophie, I need to talk to Damon. Well, looks like I'm officially on vacation. Whether I like it or not, I hope I can reopen soon. I start to miss my regulars after a while. Okay, so the drought is affecting Damon's bar to the point that it's closed. Let's go see Amira. Natalia fainted in her forge yesterday. I'm not saying this to embarrass her, but she keeps forgetting to hydrate. This heat is dangerous, and it sneaks up on you. Drink water, okay? Good advice. Okay, I'm gonna go check the notice board because there was a quest for Amira before, and I wasn't able to get it, but I should be able to now. There we go. Let's go hand this off to her right away. And maybe we can go over to Ravenwood Hollow after. You brought the ingredients I asked for. They're just what I needed. I wouldn't want anyone to stay sick when I can help. I keep asking Amira to spill the botanicals she's using. But she won't. Okay. Now let's try our broom out. Move the cursor around the map to travel via broomstick. Oh. So I can just select where I want to go. Um, yeah, I think I like this. Let's head up to the pass. Okay. And away we go. Very nice. Fly, my pretty. Fly the broomstick for the first time. Nice. Let's go see if we can find Jiba. Oh, I see her. Come in, Tara. Care for a mopping? Oh, I'm celebrating. I've just finished analyzing my first set of barometric readings. They suggest there's some sort of pressure barrier around the island. There really is something odd happening here. Tell me, have you noticed anything dodgy about the weather since you've arrived? Okay, so I can say I guess all weather is strange. No, I've noticed nothing. I'm gonna go, I guess. Well, yes, but I am just a 
A simple country farmer, ma'am. <laughs> Couldn't tell you a thing about the weather. A simple city girl turned farmer, you mean? I know you came here in the spring. I have to get to the bottom of this. What was grad school for otherwise? But sometimes I wasn't certain I'd make it. But now, here I am, in my own weather observatory. Oh, listen to me, Ramble. You're very kind, Tara. Come back anytime. Okay. Here's a question, fellow newcomer. Does Fairhaven's history fascinate you too, or is it just me? Um, I can say I love it, or it's just you. I love it. Yes, it does. Fairhaven may be small, but it's complex. My feelings exactly! So many people from the world over have come to the island. You've gone quite deep into the mines, haven't you? I find that place especially intriguing. There was once a thriving mine operation down there, but it halted quite suddenly not too long ago. If you find anything in the mines that explains the place's history, will you tell me? That's kind of vague, but, uh, sure. Okay, so look for artifacts in the bottom level of the mine and take them to Jiba. Okay, interesting. So I don't need to talk to her about the rain. Well, who else would I be talking to, I wonder? Yeah, I still need to talk to one more person. Okay. Well, I wonder if I should change the season now. Or should I wait? I'm not sure what will happen to my lime tree or my any of my other trees for that matter. Let's check out this dirt pile. Got some money. We'll take the mint. And of course the nigella can come with us. Another dirt pile. Is it a... Uh... <gasps> It is! A recipe! Texas brownie. Is it a... <gasps> it is! A recipe! So jeweled rice. Two recipes in a row. Well, it is getting pretty late. Maybe we'll hop on our broom. <laughs> no, I just want to get this almond. <laughs> okay. I guess I'm getting the wood. Okay. Okay, let's talk to the High Priestess. First, I'm going to make a donation, though. I certainly have a lot of poppy. There we go. And let's talk. Actually, let me see if I can purchase anything from Shelby. Magic is more about working with chaos than trying to control it. The good news is that life's very much the same. Okay. No, I can't talk to him. Okay, let's talk to Lena. It's time to change the season. Are you ready for autumn? Um, yes. I'm ready. Let's do this. Wonderful. Everyone, take your positions. By this flame, 
and by this sacred sign, be this the essence of the divine. We call the spirits of the harvest. We call forth the healing power of water. Once again, we turn the wheel of the year. We say farewell to the maiden summer. And we welcome autumn. Was it a vision, Farseer? The town is soon to be beset by a dark force. What dark force? Did you see who it was? I couldn't see it clearly, but it's the same. It's the vision that first brought you here, isn't it, Farseer? We've long known this day would come. What day? What's happening? We'll discuss this later. The Farseer must rest. We all should get some sleep. We will need all our strength to prepare for what lies ahead. Well, that was very foreboding. Okay, so for crying drought loud task complete. So we've got an incantation to permanently increase your magic bar. Like okay. storms that make the river sing. Fill my magic from the spring. Okay. So now it is officially fall, and something dark is coming. I wonder what that is. Well, it's definitely not something good. But we still have quite a bit of energy. Let's chop down this tree over here. I'll grab the mushroom. Okay, let's head back to the farm. I was hoping to go over to Ravenwood Hollow, but it is too late now. We'll have to go there tomorrow. Okay, let's collect some more forage. We'll clear out some of these logs. And this tree as well, I guess. Okay, and there's some more reeds over here. Let's grab those. Okay, um, let's see if there's anything we can cook. Uh, no. We can't cook anything, my goodness. Okay, let's check in the basement. And we've got some levitation potion ready. And let's make some miracle grow. Essence of copper is ready. Let's make an essence of silver next. And speed boost. We still can't make that. Still need to get that seaweed. Okay, let's head on up to bed. Should I go to bed? Okay, well that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.